Jazzy here. Thanks for tuning in with me. And on today's video, I am going to be joined by my daughter, Honey, and my daughter, Blue. So first thing you want to do before you start actually decorating your organizers is cleaning, disinfecting, and dusting the frames and drawers. Here you see we have this beautiful, sparkling, ruby pink, glitter paper, emerald green, this beautiful ocean blue, this silver chrome color, and my favorite black diamond. Ooh la la. So I'll be using black, silver, and blue for my frame. Blue and Honey will be using the pink and green. Here you can see I'm just sort of playing with the paper to figure out where I want each color. I've decided to keep the ocean blue in the middle, silver on the left and right, and the black in the front and back. Once you've got your colors placed where you need them, you can measure them and cut them as necessary. I pretty much just cut each paper in half for the sides and front and back, and then cut off any excess that I needed to after. Here we're using hot glue to place them on top. So I've started with making big ooey gooey blobs in each corner and then vigorously spreading out the rest on each paper. Once you flip it over, you wanna spread out any bumps of glue or air bubbles that you may have underneath the paper. See, isn't she lovely already? Next, I've used the scrap paper to cut out some darling little shapes. I chose one shape for mine, but you can go crazy and pick as many shapes as you like. I chose, in my opinion, the most adorable shape, which is the heart. And my favorite color, black. And I haven't really picked a pattern or anything to where I'm placing them. I'm just sort of randomly spreading them all over the top. Next, we're going to be hot gluing this clear glass marble looking thingy I like to call dragon scales. Here, I'm putting five in the middle. This sort of resembles a flower. And then five across the top of the handle. Next, I'm gluing a strip of this sort of metal ribbon on each side that I just happen to have laying around. It's supposed to resemble diamonds or rhinestones, but there actually doesn't have any in them. You can find the same sort of ribbon at Dollar General or Dollar Tree if you're interested. Last but not least, I'm gluing three of these dragon scales in an oval shape on top of each corner of the frame, like so. Cute, right? And that's my final look. Ta-da! Next, we're going to be working on Honey's organizer. She cut out all the shapes herself, which she sort of just picked at random, whatever inspired her. And then we're placing them on top, also at random. Now here, she chose to do four of the dragon scales in the center of each drawer. And she insisted that she glue on the items herself. Such a big girl. Please, if you have any kiddos using these items, make sure there's an adult supervising. And here's her beautiful final look. Next on Blue's Blue Organizer, <laughs> she decided to use double shapes in the center. Here you can see she has pink and green. She chose to pick two shapes for her patterns. All her pink paper is shaped like a heart and all her green is shaped like a diamond. Next we're putting a shape down each center of each drawer. Heart on top and bottom, diamond in the middle. Next, we're placing one dragon scale on top of each shape after letting the glue dry for about a minute or two. Then we're placing one on each left of each drawer, one in the center, and then one on the right. That's her final look. Thanks for watching, guys. Stay beautiful. Love ya. Bye.